Hi, it's Mike here from Know Your Mind. Good to be with you. I was sitting at home thinking about communication skills. So I thought I would share with you some very simple language patterns which can go a long way to help you to enhance your communication skills and in particular to be more influential and more persuasive. I think it's fair to say that in life your ability to succeed will, to a large degree, depend upon how well you do communicate and in particular how influential you really are, how persuasive you are. So the three patterns we'll cover in a very brief session are cause and effect, complex equivalences and the very simple linkage word AND. Now let's look at cause and effect. First of all what we do is look for the outcome, what do you want to achieve, what's the objective and let's call that why. And then we'll look for something which we know is happening already, some sort of a fact and we'll call that X. So the idea is to link X to Y in a way that it seems to link the two together to make it seem as if they belong together. And we use an cause and effect word to do that. So for example, we might say something like, the fact that you're listening to this causes you to want to use this pattern in your everyday life. Now we can also use a softener to make it more agreeable, more acceptable. Here we might say the fact that you're listening to this may cause you to use this pattern in your daily interactions to improve your persuasive skills. Now there are other cause and effect words such as allows, creates, makes and the word because, because itself is quite a powerful word. Now let's look at complex equivalences. Here in a very similar process we simply look for the outcome again, we'll call that Y and we'll look for something that's happening already, we'll call that X and then we link the two together with a complex equivalences word such as means, so X means Y. The fact that you're listening to this means you want to take your skills to the next level. And again we can use a softener. The fact that you're listening to this perhaps means you want to take your skills in a new direction. Now the word because, which is a cause and effect word, is a very powerful word as I've just said. Now because most people seem to really respond to requests when you give them reasons, even if the reason itself is not that persuasive or not that powerful. They seem to still respond. So because you're listening to this, you may want to take your skills in a new direction. It seems to be more compelling. And because you're listening to this, it means you want to do so and so. So use the word because more liberally in your everyday engagement. You will find what you say is more accepted and people will respond almost always to whatever you're requesting. The third pattern is the simple linkage word AND. Here we make two statements linked together by the word AND and it seems to give the impression that somehow the two are connected even though they may not be. So for example we might say you are sitting here and learning. It just gives that impression that somehow they are connected. So there are the three simple language patterns cause and effect, X causes Y, complex equivalences, X means Y and then using the word AND to link two statements together.